Do dogs ward off evil? If you're talking about the literal pitchfork-wielding redhorn type of evil, I think we're wading into some murky supernatural waters there. However, if we're talking about dogs providing a sense of security and warding off nefarious intentions, then absolutely, there's something there. First off, we can't ignore the long-held belief in various cultures that dogs have a sort of sixth sense. They purportedly can sniff out bad intentions, or even sense supernatural presences that are invisible to us mere humans. History is littered with tales of dogs growling at empty corners or refusing to enter a room, and some people interpret these behaviors as evidence of dogs detecting something evil, or at least not quite right. From a more pragmatic standpoint, think about the roles dogs have played alongside humans for centuries. They've been protectors, guardians, herders, and have even served in law enforcement and military capacities. There's a reason why beware of dog signs are so effective. Even in Portland, a city known for its friendly and community-focused vibes, you'd think twice about trespassing in a yard with a German shepherd staring you down. Dogs are also amazingly intuitive when it comes to reading body language and picking up on distress in their humans. They often act as emotional barometers and may naturally become protective if they sense their owner is scared or under threat. So do dogs ward off evil? If by evil we mean danger, intruders, or negative energy, their track record is pretty solid. They're loyal, protective, and their bark alone can make the shadiest character think twice about approaching. Whether they're actually seeing specters we can't or just excellent at reading the room, dogs definitely bring a lot of good. Maybe they can handle a little evil too.